I really do just look like Goob from Meet the Robinsons. Is he even fucking called Goob? There's been a lot of drama and a lot of drama involving the house and I, an avid TikTok user, have been keeping up with all this drama and it's honestly been the highlight of my day, my week, probably 2020 as a whole. Like what else has really happened? In fact, we'll not even say that because bitch, a lot has happened in 2020. I also burnt my tongue today on a cup of tea, so... That's how exciting my life's been. I'm not gonna lie, I have been sat in bed watching Hollywood Fix videos all day long, like the entire day. It's now seven o'clock in the evening. I should have uploaded today, but I didn't because I had nothing to film. And I was like, you know what? I don't know what the fuck I wanna film. Is there anything I wanna film right now? No. What do I wanna do right now? Just lay in bed and watch Hollywood Fix videos? Correct. And then I had the genius idea of why don't we stop for a second, not watch anymore, and watch them together. We were a movie. You be the right guy. Ding. Delightful moment, applause. So that is exactly what we're gonna do. I'm gonna sit here, I'm gonna react, respond, and chat about some of these Hollywood Fix videos and one just got uploaded 18 minutes ago. So without further ado, I'm gonna bob my screen recording on. Can't really remember how to do it. Oh, how do I screen record? Like this, bish bash, boom, big bing bing bong. Screaming. Oh, I just nearly threw up. Screen record. Screen record. What's up, guys? Okay, you're about to head out. About to mobilize. Got the oh, is, this, is this new merch here? What's going on here? Yeah, nothing new. Nothing new. What's up, Mia? How you doing? More drops in the clothing line. <laughs> Who is? Me and Mia. Really? What's it called? It's gonna be called Loverboy. Nice. It's gonna be like men's hoodies made for girls that come already like with cologne on them, so it's like a boyfriend hoodie. Mr. Thomas, Mr. Daisy Keach, out of the house and then stole her money. Thomas said he's bringing out hoodies. But they're gonna come with cologne on. Good evening, paedophiles. But it's not gonna be very um, ethical mass producing these hoodies with cologne on. Or like kids sweat from the factories that produce them. <gasps> and we got the fly new merch. Hey, what up, Brian? What up, Sean? What's up, everybody? And we got the new How do all these people <laughs> fuck me? <laughs> Oh, and your pussy tank. Oh, man. Oh, no. What the fuck is taking so long? Tag yourself. I'm the girl in the back. This feels weird. Like, this is bizarre. Like, it is bizarre. And I also don't know what I'd do if this were me in that situation. Like, I'm trying to say everything from their perspective. Like, obviously, they're young guys. They've been, like, given this crazy lifestyle, like, within, like, the space of, like, a year or so. They probably don't know how to act themselves. And I know for a fact, if a bunch of girls were stood outside the car, like, filming me and shit, I wouldn't know what to do. But, like... The girls are stood so he can't close the door. Like, this is just. This feels awkward. I feel like these people need security. Watch her. Can you say hi? <laughs> he didn't want to say watch her ass, but this girl's full fucking ass is in the car. <laughs> oh, this one has 2.6 million views, damn. Like, how do these people know? How do these people know that these they're there? You got Video. Yeah! Oh, that's the blonde girl, then why is she staring like that? <laughs> Watch. Why? What the fuck has this bitch had for lunch, dinner, or whatever they've just eaten? This bitch just had a bowl of fucking like crack. Charlie's really fucking sweet. Like, she really, really. Seems like a nice girl. And she's also, I feel like they've all been media trained. Because like, if someone asked me that shit after all the drama, if you don't know the drama that's gone off, then like, where the fuck have you been? But after all the drama that's gone off, like this was the day after the drama, I would be like, fuck that bitch. But she handles herself really well. Yes. There you go, okay. You this girl seems sweet as well. <laughs> Why is this picture? Why are her eyes like that? What is she had for lunch? Like, what is this girl's diet? Because I can tell you what I think it is. Um, anyway, so. Big boobs. Are you going to the Uber? <sighs> this girl's waiting for an Uber. The Uber driver sat there in his car, like. While Charlie Develli is over there, like. Oh 
my god, there's so many fucking people that are an actual paparazzi to me, but I was like, this is crazy. Why is this bitch with eyes like that? Are you going to the Uber? Like, salute. Holy fuck, everyone in that restaurant's also now like. Also, why are they grabbing her arm like that? But she's obviously, ooh, she's obviously trying to leave. I hate this. She's obviously trying to leave. Oh, I just fucking hate this entire thing. Like the way she just grabbed her arm like that. Like what? Like they're really sweet. And I think the girls who are actually grabbing her seem really nice as well. Like I've seen a lot of these videos and a lot of people are just like, and then get a selfie and leave. And I like that these girls are like actually having a conversation with her and trying to be like friendly with her. I know Charlie seems like she's really nice, but you can tell she wants to leave and get in the Uber with her sister and fucking crackhead Cora over here. I don't know who the fuck she is. No offense to that girl, by the way. She was probably really sweet and it's probably just, she has big eyes. But you can tell she's trying to leave. Bye. Bye guys, have a good night. I wonder what that Uber driver's thinking. Like, I wonder if he knows who these girls are or if he's gonna go home to like his kids and be like, so I picked up three girls on Rodeo Drive earlier. Um, in fact, that's not even Rodeo Drive. Me saying I know LA. I don't think he'll know him. Maybe he d he doesn't know him. He's gonna go home to his kids and be like, so I picked up some Charlie girl today. That's fine. Oh God. This is the night of... Yeah, Jada just said I wonder who called them. Weird. Like, one of these bitches, one of you bitches, is telling this guy where everyone is. And like, I get it, because it is making them more like... It's boosting their status. I'm sweating for my eyeballs. Like, my eyeball and my eyelid is wet. It's moist. One of the Hype House members is calling paparazzi on their every move. And I get it's boosting their, like, status, because then everyone's seeing this, and this video's getting millions and millions of views, and it's, like, putting them in a different realm. Like, Hollywood fix only, like, videos Kylie Jenner, Justin Bieber. It's putting them in like a new realm in the media and I get it's like making them better as brands But like this is fucking weird. These are a bunch of teenage kids stood outside their house at whatever time at night Arguing because this bitch just called all these boys cheaters and this Guy's just videoing it and I'm watching it. I'm enjoying it. Fantastic. So we are in it. Not to fight, not to do any of that. We just want to talk to a guy one on one, man to man, right? Yeah. Oh, I like to remember this. This kind of came to me wrong. So basically, I think that he also, kind of got what is that guy in the back wearing? Like, what is that? Did he come here on a fucking jet ski? Like, what is that? What is what is he wearing? And also, who is this guy? Who are these people? We're just gonna leave that there. We're gonna close the chapter, close the book, and that's enough Hollywood fix for one day. I feel like I may have just birthed a new series called Keeping, Keeping Up With The TikTokers. I feel like that's already a thing. Keeping up with the beauty gurus, that's Sebastian Williams. And I'm gonna do keeping up with the TikTokers. So on that note, if you do wanna see more videos where I react to paparazzi videos, I find them the weirdest, most uncomfortable thing ever. And I know as soon as Addison Rae spotted out in public, it's gonna be another one and it's gonna be awkward. So if you want me to make this a series on my channel, smash a big thumbs up. I mean no hate against any of these people, any of these TikTokers, I watch them all. I'm like a 12 year old kid, even though I'm 21 and I'm invested in all this literal teenage drama. And I kinda love it and I'm kinda here for it. I kinda wanna go to a Louis Anastasia and bring Hollywood fix. So 10 likes and I'll do it. Bye. Also, no Beck, if you're watching this by any chance, give me your face. Bye. I think my neighbors are fucker. Hello, Miss Coochie. Oh, I really think my neighbors are having sex right now. Cute couple alert! Oh hey, what's my god! Right? Right? <laughs> no. Whoa, hey, this Whoa. is like, this is like my sister. Uh, I think the fuck not, you trick ass.